So let's look at the eye here, right? So there are three things I want you to know um, just looking at this particular model. Um, so right here in white is going to be our sclera. And the clear portion of the eye, so it's where it's transparent, that's going to be our cornea. And do you see where it's colored? That is going to be our iris. And where it is black, and I'm going to use a yellow so it can actually, you can actually see it, um, that is going to be our pupil. Okay? Um, I always get every year... Um, how I could ask the conjunctiva versus the sclera. So when I'm looking at the model uh, and I'm pointing to the white, you hopefully you're just going to think sclera. But if I were to ask you on the model, I would have to ask you uh, what mucous membrane covers this structure, right? So uh, again, uh, if, if I were to ask you where the conjunctiva is, uh, I would likely ask you that on um, an actual picture that we saw in the previous um, slide rather than than the model but if I did ask you on the model I would definitely ask you uh, about the mucous membrane that covers uh, this structure so let's take a look at these structures and I, what I want to do is sort of highlight the structures we do need to know so we do need to know the ciliary body we also need to know the ciliary, ciliary zonule the ciliary zonule uh, another word for this is the suspensory ligament. We also should know the cornea, which is going to be the transparent portion of the eye. Um, the iris, which is going to be the colored portion of our eye. The pupil, which appears black and is the whole of our eye. The lens, which is going to be inside of our eye and is going to be held together by um, the suspensory ligaments, um, which is or these. Um, the, the other thing that we need to, uh, that you should know, um, is the posterior chamber or the posterior segment, um, which is going to be the back portion of the eye. Uh, and then you're going to have the anterior segment, uh, which is going to be the front part of the eye. And again, uh, the anterior segment, if I were to shade that in, uh, it would it would kind of look a little bit like this so if I were kind of to shade it all in like this and what's cool is that anything anything in front of the lens is the anterior segment and that's going to contain lots of aqueous humor uh, and the aqueous humor is going to be a watery fluid and anything behind the lens uh, is going to be very gelatinous and that's going to be that's going to be our posterior chamber our posterior segment and that's going to be, be filled with a vitreous humor um, the other structures you should know is the sclera. The sclera is going to be the outer portion of the eye, and it's going to appear white. Underneath the sclera uh, is going to be our choroid. Sometimes we call this the vascular layer. And then underneath the choroid or vascular layer is going to be the retina. And the retina are going to have the rods and cones, which allow for us to see. And sometimes we call this the sensory layer. Um, the other thing that you should know um, will be uh, the, the fovea centralis. So the fovea centralis is a part of the eye uh, in which um, we focus our uh, central vision on. So when you're looking at a video or you're looking at your paper, uh, you're focusing the image on your fovea centralis. Um, you also need to know uh, the optic nerve and you should be familiar with the optic disc. Right? And the optic disc uh, is when the optic nerve exits the eye. Uh, that exiting leads the, this part of the eye where there's no rods or cones. Uh, and that's an uh, optic disc, or sometimes we call that the blind spot. So this um, is a model of the picture we just saw. And in white, um, you hopefully you know that this is going to be our sclera. Um, and uh, now that we take our sclera off, when we're looking at it in brown, this would be our vascular layer, and we would call this our choroid. And when we open the eye completely up, um, we see our 
uh, in this salmon color here, um, where we are going to actually see our retina, right? And so uh, we kind of had those three layers. We had the fibrous layer, which is going to be white. Uh, and then underneath that, you're going to have that vascular layer, which is called your choroid, which look kind of dark or purplish. Uh, and then inside, we're going to have uh, that sensory layer or retina, uh, which appears sort of this salmon or beige color. Uh, uh, right here. Um, you also can see, and I'm highlighting it here, uh, the posterior chamber. So our posterior chamber would be uh, where I'm highlighting it, and this would have lots and lots and lots of uh, vitreous humor and be very gelatinous, uh, while our aqueous humor, uh, and maybe I'll use a little bit of green, our aqueous humor uh, would be uh, here. And that would be filled with a, uh, a much water, a much more watery, watery fluid.